Hey guys, I am back with another video. It's slightly less kind of exciting I guess. Well it's exciting for me but slightly less kind of production value of my lookbook that I just posted last. I had loads of really great response for it so thank you very much if you subscribed since then. Today's video is going to be kind of more sit down and talky as I've ordered a package from Korea. I'm just covering up my dress there going to be a haul for such unboxing as I'm literally unboxing it in front of you of the things that I ordered from Beautynet Korea. I will leave a link down below to the website. It feels like Korean beauty is definitely becoming a kind of more trendy and popular thing to try out as a lot of people know that Asian cosmetics are kind of higher advanced than we are. Um, but I was inspired by my friend Chaz. I will link her channel down below and her haul video. I was like yes I must do this. I cannot remember when I ordered this but it it came relatively quickly, within about a week, two weeks-ish. So I will cut into the box and show you all the goodies that I got. I can't even remember what I ordered because it was quite a while ago. And everything is nice and bubble wrapped. So I'll take all of the shocking amounts of bubble wrap out. And the first things on top I can see are loads of little samples. Korean um, brands do send a lot of samples, so I have like a massive handful here, which is really exciting because there was a lot of things that I did want to try, but I didn't want to order so much stuff. And there is also a little thank you note from the website, which I said I'd leave down below. So yeah. So we have um, two little samples of a brightening peeling gel a cucumber, uh, lettuce and cucumber watery cream. I don't really know what that is, but that's from Skin Food, which is a really popular brand that I've heard of. A Tony Moly, Tony Moly, Tony Moly, hand, banana hand milk, which again, very popular brand and adorable little packaging. Another Tony Moly product, which is Panda's Dream White Cream, which is in a little panda, which is the cutest thing in the world. And then there is three samples of mayu, mayu, I want to say mayu, 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 healing face cream, horse oil, that's, that's interesting choice of animal product, but we'll get into that further into the thing, and there's three of those. So those are all the, oh no, there's one more. And the last thing is another Tony Moly product, which is Panda's Dream Eye Patch, which are eye patches for under eye circles I imagine again little panda the cutest thing in the world I'll just dive into the box this is what it looks like now with all of my products in there um, and I will just dive into the first thing I see okay this is the Etude House Wonder Pore Freshener it's supposed to be kind of like a toner I think effectively cleans the inside and outside of pores um, after morning and evening cleansing before skincare so I'm pretty sure it's kind of like a toner just to get rid of all the impurities and such and it comes in this adorable little package but this didn't spill or anything which I'm really really glad of glad, glad of. and I don't actually have a toner at the moment so let's hope that this does some good things the next thing is bubble wrapped up I think there's two things in here, maybe two, maybe one, but this is something I was really looking forward to because the packaging is so adorable and it is a compact powder that is called Cat's Wink Clear Packed, a little cat and has a little puff and powder and a mirror in there and that's the most adorable thing. We'll do a close up on the actual like pattern in the pan because that is so cute um, yeah and the packaging that goes over it makes it look adorable also because there's like little extra like, slide it out. next two things are all kind of variations of the same thing as I wanted to I don't know which one to get basically so I ordered three of the egg pour um, Tony Moly kind of balms so there's three here there's the blackhead steam balm the tightening cool pack and the silky, uh, silky smooth balm and they all do different things so the blackhead steam balm is kind of like a balm that you massage in and it 
removes skin cells and other gross things that are in your pores for slash blackheads um, and they all look really adorable actually they look like little eggs I saw these and they are so cute oh my goodness and the inside oh wow okay oh my goodness they smell good they smell kind of um like clearer cell but yeah they have kind of like little tiny micro bead looking granules in so I guess this is kind of like an exfoliator type thing and there's the little lid that looks like a yolk that is adorable oh my goodness so that's the blackhead steam balm then in cool pack kind of tightens up your pores obviously um, by making them cooler once you've opened them with steam or water, if you've done all the exfoliating and everything's all open and you know exposed, then this will tighten them up, I imagine. Again, it's another egg, just slightly different colour, but it has the same little yolky looking bit. Oh wow. And that kind of looks like a clay mask type thing. It smells similar to the other one, but it kind of looks like a mousse. That's very cold. Oh, that's really cold. That's so strange. And then they last egg pour thing I got is the Silky Smooth Balm which is a primer to put on before you put on your makeup. Again it's this one's gold packaging but has the little egg yolky thing and it is like a cream type. Ooh, it feels kind of like um, the texture of the Maybelline baby skin but in like a lip balm form if that makes any sense considering it's a balm that would make sense so I'm really impressed with those they are not only adorable but looks like they're gonna be quite useful and the last couple of things I have are in bubble wrap the first thing I see is the thing that I was most exciting about which is the weirdest thing probably that I ordered but also one of the coolest things and it is the multifunction formula snail recovery gel cream which um, lightweight snail gel cream containing 74% of snail secretion filtrate and this is you put this on after cleansing and apparently it will make your face amazing I've <laughs> I don't know, all I know is that it's got snails in it, well not actual snails, snail secretions. Um, I'm scared of how this is going to smell or just feel in general. Okay, it has a little safety seal on. Okay, it's a clear gel. This is so weird. Ooh, okay, okay. It doesn't smell like anything at all, but it's like quite smooth. It's not greasy at all, that's really nice. Okay, cool, cool. That's not as scary as I thought it was gonna be. The last two things I have are makeup products. This is the Chubby Jelly Tint Pack in Cherry Red. And it's basically like a lip stain. You put it on your lips, wait for it to dry, and then you peel it off, and then it becomes a lip stain on your lips. This looks like a normal kind of red tube of thing if you want me to try this out on camera or something like that that could be really interesting I guess I took it good terribly wrong the last thing I have is a blush so this is the cushion blusher by Pipira I believe um, and I got it in please pink and it is an adorable color I'm not sure how long it takes to dry on the skin thank you guys for watching this has been my Korean beauty for slash skincare haul um, I'm really excited to try all of these things. If you do want me to try them and do another update video of mini reviews, then just let me know down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and comment if you have anything interesting to say or just comment in general. And if you're feeling really, really generous, please give me a subscribe. It means the world to me and I will see you guys soon.